Hey everybody and welcome. I said the wrong name. It's it's the Citadel. It's about time you two decided to show up. Nice to see you too. Do they have you on the floor now? There's no time for jokes, Dexter. Call and Maya kidnapped us to sap our energies to power their abominable machine. It appears they have combined the functional remains of a precursor robot with scavenged artifacts from across the land. Then they added a few diabolical additions of their own, creating the one thing capable of opening the dark eco silos. If you can free the four of us, we can use our combined powers to break the force shield surrounding the robot before they use it to destroy the world. So. Now we're starting off with, well, some rescuing. We need to call to get all of the sages. And as a little bit of an... to point it out, uh, if you're not familiar with the robot in the middle there, remember back in Spider Cavern, the big... Spider Cannon, Spider Cave? The big bad robot in the middle? I felt, yeah. So if you remember that one, you're looking at it. Just a little bit modified, of course. Or a lot. Okay, I think we're going to go this way first. I can't remember if there's any real, well, way to do this and or right order for this. I'm just kind of doing what I feel for. Come on. Uh, each one of these uh, hallways, yeah, hallways, is actually a kind of labyrinth, or not that labyrinth, it's a challenge of some sort. Need to do special, special tasks for while well, completing. This is pretty easy, you just, well, try not to, well, fail. <laughs> not sure, sure how else to. What? I did not press the X button. There. Come on, there's only one left. Thank you. As you see right here, this is kind of the point with this. You need to. Ah, oh, damn it! Stand in the middle. Yes! <laughs> I had enough. Sweet. So, that was the blue eco. No, oh, red eco. Well, oh. okay then. This part's going to be a pretty cutscene heavy though, so. Prepare. Yeah, a little bit back to the music. You can actually hear at this part the pure electronic electronics and technology in the music. The <laughs> Why did I even bother? No, I want to go down. Thank you. I think this probably is going to be a two-parter, but hopefully not. 
Okay. See the path already. Ah, that was close. Okay, hopefully that that was the last one. Okay. I want that last one. There. Oh no. This is going to take a while. Okay, I want to give that a second try. Or not. Damn it. Well, that's probably why it's that big. Ah. And that's that. Uh, that should be each and every one of those, yes. And that's the second power cell. Yes! Haha, <laughs> you almost said it wrong. Good work, fellows. Old Samus was right about you. At the
yeah, what I was going to, well, say is that uh, as you quite clearly can tell, most of the challenges are actually based on Blue Eco, not on the power of the Sage. And I think that's kind of sad that they didn't make well dif different challenges for the different. There are different, but that the Blue Eco Sage don't have hits his own little mini game that is just involving blue, involving Blue Eco, and that the Red Sage just has Red Sage, no Red Eco powers, and you know the good old basics of video game logic. Whoop, whoop, whoop. So the last one is on the top, I think. Whoopsie! Luckily, it resets. Okay, at least we got all of the... Um, shut up. We got all of the boxes, and now... Oh, back here. Well, it's that, not that far. Finnish! Swedish! Norwegian! Yay! We got each and every one. Okay. Uh, here. Bam. Now we have all saved all sages. Yay! Or three or four because the fourth one is Seamus. You know how long I've been in here. What took you so long? Is that man on a clock on his head? Oh, it didn't work. 
I was trying to do was actually to uh, what's it called? Uh, to use the blue eco to collect all the orbs, so I didn't have to well waste time on time on it myself. Second run for its money. Ten more, that should be right. Uh, square. So last two should be... Yep. Just thinking to myself. Trying to well, have some, something to come to it all. What you want to do is to go up on this. See up there, the last one. But I'm going to go this way first because his memory serves pretty well. Yep, that's the end. I'm going to go over here. Last one. Yes, please, thank you. Now we have collected every uh, precursor orb in the game. We just released the last sage. Good work, boys. You're real heroes now. I'll combine my green eco power with the other three sages, and together we'll open the shield door surrounding the precursor robot. Yeah, yeah, that sounds like a good start. And then after you guys open that shield, what are you gonna do about the robot? Nothing, Daxter. We have to keep the shield open. It's up to you two to figure out how to destroy the robot. Oh, great. I get to help the guy that turned me into a furball destroy the only person who can turn me back! First, save the world. Then we try to convince Paul to help Daxter. So everybody, this has been a Cosmic Illusion. Please like, subscribe if you want to see more videos. And in the next part, we're going to kick their ass. Dun, dun, dun. Bye!